Once in a city, there was a yearly tradition where parents would take their children to visit their grandparents' house during the summer vacations. They would stay there for about 10 to 20 days and then return home. This became a yearly routine, and as the boy grew older, he began to long for a chance to go to his grandparents' house on his own. One day, he gathered the courage to express his desire to his parents. He said, Mom and Dad, I'm now old enough to go to Grandma and Grandpa's house by myself. Can you please allow me to make this journey alone? His parents were initially hesitant, concerned about his safety and well-being. However, after seeing his determination and understanding of the responsibilities involved, they reluctantly agreed. The day of departure arrived. His father took him to the train station. They found his seat on the train, and his father carefully explained all the precautions he should take during the journey. The boy assured his father that he remembered everything and not to worry. As the train pulled out of the station, his father leaned out of the window and spoke to him. He handed the boy an envelope and said, Son, if you ever feel scared or unsure during the journey, open this envelope and read what's inside. The boy tucked the envelope into his pocket, and his father waved him goodbye. The train continued on its journey, stopping at various stations where passengers boarded and disembarked. People came and went, but the boy felt a growing sense of loneliness as he traveled on his own for the first time. At the next station, a stranger with a rather intimidating face entered the train. The boy couldn't help but steal glances at him and the man's appearance filled him with fear and anxiety. He tried closing his eyes and pretending to sleep, but the image of the fearsome stranger haunted his thoughts. As the journey continued, the boy's anxiety grew. He couldn't shake the feeling of being alone and vulnerable. That's when he remembered the envelope his father had given him. With trembling hands, he took it out of his pocket and opened it. Inside, he found a letter from his father. In the letter, his father had written, Don't be afraid, my son. I am in the compartment next to yours, on this very train. You are not alone in this journey. Remember, I am with you every step of the way. Upon reading those words, a wave of relief washed over the boy. The fear and loneliness he had felt earlier dissipated. He realized that he was never truly alone, his father was there, watching over him from the next compartment. With renewed confidence, he closed the envelope and continued his journey with a sense of security. My dear friends, life is much like this journey. When we were sent into this world by the Divine, we were given a letter, a message of reassurance. The message says, Do not fear, for I am with you every moment, every step of the way. In times of difficulty, when we face challenges that seem insurmountable, it's important to remember this message. We may feel alone and vulnerable, but we are never truly alone. The Divine is with us, guiding us through life's journey. So, let us hold on to faith and trust, especially in these challenging times. Let us remember that everything is in the hands of the Divine, and with unwavering belief, we can overcome any obstacle. Just like the boy on the train, we have the assurance that we are not alone on this journey. This is the little learnings for you. Be happy and keep learning.